Thank you for your letter. I, I would like to apologize. I should never have declared my feelings. Yes, but you would not be yourself had you not. <laughs> I admired your letter. Admired? Yes. Your candor. I was moved by it. However, I would not wish you to feel compromised by its being in my possession. It's, it's yours. Please. It's yours. our senses, but lowers our perceptions. I'm not someone who is made for love or marriage. You, you, you do not return my feelings. I cannot. Can't you see where this leads? Hmm. A declaration? A kiss? A wedding, family, obligation, boredom, adultery. Is that really the future that you had in mind for yourself? No. No. I, I believe in, in the possibility of... Um, of what? I, I'm sorry if I've upset you, but please believe me, I say this for your own good. You are young and impressionable. Anyone, any stranger could have stumbled into your life and aroused your romantic imagination. I'm sorry if I've led you to believe uh, something else. Um, do you feel nothing? I am fond of you. I think that you are. I think you are charming, and I'm distressed that you are in pain. But the, the pain you feel today will, I suspect, leave you quite soon. I think it will evaporate, and then you'll be surprised that you ever felt for me. And in time, you'll meet someone more deserving of your love. Is that the future you predict for me? Yes. You interpret my heart, my nature as you wish to believe it. In truth, I have no secret longing to be saved from myself. I think we should return to your guests. <laughs> 